Everyone's eyes, they all want this championship. You'll have to forgive me for the lack of information on this title, but I have heard that it's highly coveted. Well, my sources sent me a VHS tape of this title's greatest matches, and there were some all-time classics. Really? Okay, can I borrow that tape, Corey? Absolutely not, Saxon. I'd be doing a disservice to my sources. Oh, wow. German suplex! Wow, that was some reversal by Daniel Bryan. Straight punch. Daniel Bryan with a great offensive show. Championship on the line. Real quick reminder, guys. There are no disqualifications and no countouts in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. We have witnessed incredible brutality in this type of match. Corey, what could be a key factor in this one? This is a form of battle where if you have a shot, you better take it because you might not get another chance. There are no limits. There are no boundaries. Every resource is at your disposal. Every dream of destroying your opponent can become a reality. Sami Zayn with the offense. Sami Zayn is doing what he does. Get of the ring. As Corey mentioned, there's a treasure trove of weapons under the ring. Everything from kendo sticks to steel chairs to fire extinguishers. If you can think about it, it's probably under there. And when that's the case, it's not a matter of if you're going to get hurt. It's a matter of how badly you're going to get hurt. Perhaps he's thinking the ring can't contain what he has in mind here. Look out! Yes, yes, a flying goat! <laughs> wow, missed by a mile. Had that one well scouted. I don't think there's room to argue that there is a man in WWE who fights harder for what he believes in than Daniel Bryan. Whatever cause or passion inspires Bryan, there's no limit to how far it can take him. Nobody ever accused Sami Zayn of holding back. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. Sami Zayn in a tough spot here. It's extreme rules. Serious injury comes with the territory. Where in the world are these men finding the strength to continue? Uh, Sami Zayn and Daniel Bryan have incredible stamina, but their hatred fuels them even further. He's looking a little dazed, guys. And he's got nowhere to go in that corner. You brought up the passion of Daniel Bryan, Michael, and I agree, it seems limitless. There was a time when it was his connection to the WWE Universe that fueled him. But even now, the new Daniel Bryan is still fighting for what he believes in. And what more noble belief than in one's own self? Daniel Bryan knows just how much better he is physically, mentally, and environmentally than any other WWE superstar, and that's carried him straight to the top of the... Here's the pin title on the line! One, two, and he got a near fall out of it. Wow, the underdog from the underground almost got buried, but he powers out somehow. Uh-oh, Brian setting up. Uh, Daniel Bryan! The heel hooks in. This will tear your knee apart. This might be it.
take a sip of your wheatgrass juice and enjoy the new Daniel Bryan. performers in WWE just met in that ring, but Daniel Bryan proved to be the better man tonight. Yep. Well, that puts it all in perspective. Tag Team Championships on the line. May the best team win. And guys, we're ready to get this match started. So much on the line in this championship match tonight, guys. Oh, wow. Nice amateur takedown. Oh, what a four. Just a step quicker. Oh, what a strike to the back. Headlock in the corner now. He evades the attack. Big knee to the midsection. Oh, nasty impact. Angelo Dawkins with a well-timed shot. Anticipated that attack perfectly. And another reversal. Seems like we're back where we began, Michael. How impressive was that reversal? And look at the quickness by Montez Ford. He's taking it up top. Look at this. Missile drop kick finds its mark. Double face handle. Angelo Dawkins just too quick. Oh, look at this! Showing some quickness. And this match can change that fast. He just cannot be caught. Suplex! He's absorbed some damage already. And a spinning sit-out powerbomb! Boom! What a forearm! Ooh, impressive counter. And he's heading back in. He's not in a good spot here, guys. Back suplex. Oh, my God. Oh, and a backbreaker. He got in there. Good save. Keep your eyes on this one. Oh, what? oh look out. Oh, no. Elbow. He paid for that one. Man, big time. How in the world? Uh-oh. A stutter! Two superstars in pursuit of a title is awesome, but a tag team championship is twice as good. Some good action on tap here. Oh, no, we've got a problem here, guys. Brutal face buster. Winning heel kick. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no count outs. He's looking to do more. Whoa! That one fails to land. Missed the mark. This match's brutality starting to show on him. Elbow smash. Face first with a waist lock takedown. Oh, flipping the script on him there. Punch right to the face! Power bomb! He's going for the pin. You need it. No, he lets him out.
He's looking a little weary now. He's stalking his opponent all the way from the top rope. Super kick! This is the title match we've all been waiting for, guys, and so far it's delivered the goods. Abdominal stretch. It's locked in. This is a great way to wear down your opponent. He breaks out. He's not done just yet, Michael. Power bomb. Oh, my God. Up against the barrier now. I think that barrier might be the only thing holding him up. I think you're right. And he's heading back in. Oh, close line. Can he do it here? He hasn't done nearly enough to get the pin yet. Yeah, he's not done yet. Oh, here we go. Oh, man. Right point of the elbow. Oh, shows no mercy. And that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. He's running out empty right now. He is hurt. Kick to the gut. Hooked up. DDT! That is a great reversal. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. That will scramble your insides. He's looking to bring this one to the outside where things can get ugly in an instant. Super kick! God, could this be it? Dragon twist cover too soon. Oh, Montez Ford turning the tables. And again, yet another counter. It's obvious Montez Ford is feeling the pain that has been dealt out so far. I think this one's over. Can there be frustration mounting in these competitors, knowing it's going to take more to win this one? You can't let those feelings seep into your psyche. You have to keep your focus. Look at this. Snap suplex. Toss to the outside. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top rope. From the top, elbow drop. Hooked up. Just sending a message there. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Angelo Dawkins is getting ready. Night, night. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. And look at the quickness by Montez Ford. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. His opponent included. He caught him slipping. Ooh, what impact. Start wondering what it's going to take to put him away. Oh, oh man. And you know what's next, guys? Versus. Can he make him pay? He just created a prime opportunity. A trip to the local medical facility might be there. What a great win. It's such a unique style matchup. We gotta take another look. It's a very tough competition. Now you just got to take the win and build off it.
What an exciting match for the Tag Team Championship. Thank you for watching. This is for the Women's Championship, sold out here. Everyone standing in anticipation to see who truly is the best superstar in the women's division. The Women's Champion posted on social media today, nothing makes me happier than decimating whoever dares approach the peak of my mountain. Strong foreshadowing words for her opponent. Well, it might be unfortunate then that her challenger possesses the ability to move mountains and might shove the champ clean off the top. Looking a little dazed here. And she's back in the ring now. She brought her right down to the canvas. What a takedown. Bailey's on the attack. Well, that was some reversal by Tamina. And there is the reversal from Sasha Banks. Is there something to focus on when preparing for this career-altering match? you got to accept the fact that you're going to be punished like you've never been punished before. And no mercy will be given. In this situation, you can completely unload on your opponent and a referee's count can't stop you. You can set the rule book ablaze. Guillotine applying. Battling to get the upper hand. Sasha Banks on the attack. This is where Sasha Banks is at her best. For her here, guys. It's like she doesn't even know where she is. Oh no. Uh-oh, this isn't gonna end well for someone. Going up top. Wow, look at the quickness by Lacey Evans. She's leaving the ring. What's gonna happen now? Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Naomi wants everyone to know that she's in charge. Lacey Evans making her think twice. Good night. Oh, what a flying heel kick. Strong oh. kick. My goodness. Harsh impact. She returns the favor there. Whoa, it's another reversal. This is how people end up getting hurt. Perhaps took a little too long there. Indecisiveness can often come back to haunt you, Michael, as we saw there. Oh! What's up, Jawbreaker? You can pick up your teeth in the third row. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. Her again. Man, she really knows how to handle herself, huh? A well aimed strike. German suplex released. Shows no mercy. And that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. She gets her for a second time. Third time's a charm, Cole. Remember that as this match goes on. Some people might not agree, but I think sometimes Bailey can be a bit too much. She's really relying on that object a lot now. And I can't say that I blame her. Ooh, what impact. Oh, big, the champion into the cover. And Tamina quickly kicks out. Still too fresh. Ooh. What a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. Straight punch. Oh, shows no mercy. And that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. She just keeps using that. Hey, wouldn't you? Boom! <laughs> there it is. Did you hear that crack? Sasha Banks commanding respect right now. Uh-oh, gentlemen, it is turning into boss time. A surprising reversal from Sasha Banks. And Sasha with the back down, flipping her over, here it comes. Bank statement locked in. Sasha Banks, the boss is telling many, many people with this move. I don't think this one's going to be any different. Great offense by Bailey. That's twice. 
just now, Byron. Yeah, she really knows how to handle that, huh? Big elbow. Wow, what a sequence. It's about to end. Man of the day. Looks like the champ is going to retain. But now can Bailey capitalize? She got the shoulder up. That's all that counts. We are seeing a lot of guts, a lot of determination out there. You have to wonder where that one turning point to end this will come from. Perhaps feeling a little more comfortable on the outside at this point. Oh, absolutely planted. And she's back in the ring now. She's in control. There she goes. And there's the reversal from Sasha Banks. Oh, what a right! Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. Elbow smash! Got it. Like that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Suplex. Here's the pin title on the line. She may just be running on instinct at this point. She just will not give up, Cole. Sasha Banks avoided that attack and hit back even harder. And Naomi manages to reverse out of that one. Not looking good right now. Sasha Banks is really on the attack now. Here comes the boss. She just keeps using that. Hey, wouldn't you? Oh my goodness. You're kidding me. Good kick. Ooh. Ooh. And Bailey evades that one. Oh, nasty impact. Hurricane runner. Well scouted reversal there. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. Clacks off the ladder again. And that second one seemed twice as vicious as the first. All the way up. Oh, no. Good night. Shoulders down for the count. Rip found a two count. She doesn't look huggable right now. She looks down right angry. This could be big. So much damage inflicted. Kept right to the midsection. Now we have Naomi on the attack. High knee right between the shoulders. Mat slam with some attitude. Again with it. She's showing no mercy tonight. Look at Sasha Banks dishing it out. The boss in control. a lot now. And I can't say that I blame her. Boom! Oh! Well, that was some reversal by Tamina. Oh! Mm. Right hand for good measure. Sasha Banks avoids major damage there. She got lucky. And it's Bailey feeling fired up. Right across the face. Oh, what a four. Back in the ring now. Real European uppercut. And Bailey evades that one. The suspense this crowd is feeling is palpable. They are waiting with bated breath for what's to come next. Sasha Banks avoided that attack and hit back even harder. Roundhouse kick! Now we have Naomi on the attack. Look out, they're dry 
across the middle rope. Leg drop guillotine. And Naomi manages to reverse out of that one. Changes her fortune there, right across the face. Close line over the top rope. All the way to the floor. Position. Gets her again. Man, she really knows how to handle herself, huh? Battery Plex! For the win to retain the championship! Before you go up, you have to come down. She's in full control now. Oh, backbreaker! Ah, oh, what a smash! That is just insulting. That is a great reversal. Go yes. oh, right to the jaw! You can pick up your teeth in section 112. Check this out, guys. Double underhook coming. Byron's gonna love this. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Running right interference. That's twice now, Byron. Yeah, she really knows how to handle that, huh? Got it. Like that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Oh no. Oh yes! Oh, this is not good at all. The pendulum backbreaker strip. Trademark backstabber from the boss. The big statement. Big trouble. Stop. Whoa, I guess she decided not to go for the submission. And I thought she had it there, Cole. I guess not. It looks like they both did their homework heading into this one. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Here she goes. Back in the ring now. Two. Pins broken up. Now we have Naomi on the attack. Running clothesline. And Lacey Evans making her think twice. Ooh, oh, she turns it around. Looking vulnerable now, guys. Boom, boom, persistent barrage. Defenseless in the... Well, that was some reversal by Tamina. That will get your attention. She gets the job done. Very impressive. Wow, the challengers simply refuse to be denied. And now we are looking at a new champion. Unbelievable. The arena is still buzzing over that great match. that doesn't need a lot of hype or description. Just look in the ring. This is going to be an incredible six-man tag match. And you get the feeling that this crowd wants to be a part of history here in this championship match. Sit out, jawbreaker. Nailed it. Great offense by the Miz. Out of it in the corner. 
Oh. Kick break in the midsection. Textbook jumping clothesline. Oof. Double underhook suplex. Oh, and a kick break to the hamstring. Got to wonder how this is going to end, Byron. It's not going to be good. Set him up for the oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. Jumping elbow drop. Look out! That's a good way to make your presence felt. Big forearm smash. Stomping! Ouch! Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Jimmy Uso showing some expert prowess here. Technical prowess from Kofi Kingston. Big E with the excellent move to get out. Nice right hand. Uh-oh. Setting him up. Uh-oh. Oh, he's really taking it to him. Man, this is not good at all. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Here we go. Start the count. Any more punches and Sykes is going to have to take his shoes off the count. The Miz showing how A-listers do things out there. Nothing fancy here. Here it comes. Jey Uso just barely getting out of the way with the quickness. What a punch! Oh, malicious! Uh-oh! So kick! Oh, no! Oh, and the ladder finds the mark. Gonna be tough to bounce back for that one. Oh, and he lands it. Really relying on that tonight. And it's Jey Uso getting out of that one. Amazing reflexes on display. Extra neck breaker. So good. Time to end this. Standing Spanish fly. Are you kidding me? Incredible. Well, that'll hinder your modeling career. Setting that ladder up now. Hit the mark with that one. Oh, ooh, what a knee lift. Somebody better check his nose. Climbing up the ladder. Ooh, that hurt. He's very close to winning this thing, guys. Going for all the glory here, guys. Miz going up. Will it pay? Look at this. Northern Lights. Oh, what a sequence there from Jimmy Uso. New Day! You don't see this side of Big E very often. There it comes. Starring impact. Uh-oh. I'm afraid to think what's going to happen next. Using the elbow as a weapon. Set up for the... Oh, sweep. Nicely done. Diving double axe handle. With a 180, Kofi Kingston, the reversal. Ooh, impressive counter. Check out Big E's offense. Back between the ropes. Just endless knee strikes. Ooh-wee. Incoming! Uh-oh. Setting him up. Uh-oh. Neck breaker. Devastating elbow. Kick right to the midsection. 
The Miz with a nice reversal. This is it. This is going to be it. Skull crushing finale. The champ's eyes look glazed over. Jimmy Uso's just getting overwhelmed. Oh, what a knee left. On the move. Oh. oh. Incredible elevation from the big man. The ladder is up. Up, up, and away. Here we go. Biggie is setting up. Better get his head in the match instead of playing to the fans. Boom. And uppercut. Nasty. Here is Jimmy Uso in position now. It is Big E showing some agility. All right, that was... There he goes. Crashing to the floor. Toss to the outside. I don't think this is the ideal time for Jey Uso to be handing it up like this. Jey 
Russo knows better than anybody that if you ain't taunting, you ain't trying. Oh, what a kick. Ooh, no luck against Kingston there. Kofi just too fast. There he goes, crashing to the floor. We've got a climber. He's got a real chance here. I think so, Michael. One good pull, and this match is over. Uh, it's not that easy, Saxon. Oh, Corey, he unloaded there. Connected on that. Yank right off the apron. Oh, no. Oh, right off the ear in the ends of Gary. The ascent begins. Jimmy Uso is showboating here, and I don't think that's the best strategy. Oh, what a backbreaker. Man, just ugly impact. This match of the championship is his, if he could just pull it down here. Gentlemen, we are about to witness a career-defining victory. Talk about dismantling. And with that, Kofi Kingston continues his reign. These guys gave everyone their money's worth. Here's another look. exactly why these two and the bell sounds with all 6 8 275 pounds of baron corbin ready to get after it throughout his time in wwe elias has demonstrated an ability to defeat up and comers and veterans alike sometimes with a six string on their back Look, there's no doubting Elias' ability inside the ring. I think we should take up something like making model airplanes instead of live musical performances, if those qualify as such. In a bad way here, guys! Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Big time impact from way up high. Oh, such a dynamic maneuver from Elias. Ooh, what impact. Baron Corbin doesn't care about the WWE rulebook, the officials, or how the WWE universe perceives him. Corbin is a wrecking machine who will make sure anyone who stands in his way will feel the wrath of the lone wolf. Baron Corbin is giving the crowd a show, but he needs to make sure he understands what really matters. Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Ooh-wee. And what a reversal from Baron Corbin. Oh, a knee right to the face. That knee is a lethal weapon. Now back to the ring. Straight punch, nothing fancy. Whoa. This is a big all the way from the top rope. What does Baron Corbin need to do now? Things are not looking good for him Whoa. right now. Uh-oh. I had a feeling this might happen. Byron, you made a great point earlier about Baron Corbin and, well, He's all about Baron Corbin. Remember, this is a man who was thrown out of the NFL after a serious altercation during a team practice. Lone Wolf is right. No. Great reversal. I gotta say, I'm Elias setting it up. Oh boy. Swinging neck breaker. Now's the time to capitalize. I don't know if Corbin can recover. I hate to agree with you, but you're right. 
big punch finds its mark. At this juncture, you have to wonder if these superstars can keep up this pace. They're certainly being taken into the deep waters now. A leverage pin here. Hey, it's only cheating if you get caught. And there's the kick out by Baron Corbin. And we continue. And what a reversal from Baron Corbin. Just launched. Oh, such a dynamic maneuver from Elias. Nothing he hasn't been through before. Aaron Corbin got him there. Baron Corbin is giving the crowd a show, but he needs to make sure he understands what really matters. Oh no, we've got a problem here, guys. Oh! Baron Corbin is going for it early. Look, clearly not enough damage done. Got to be careful not to get counted out here. Whoa. I'll destroy your face. Uh-oh, he's in trouble here. He's trying again. Beautiful swinging neck breaker. Meet him at the pay window. Hey, Lions better not wait for Take a look once more at how Baron's rage got the best of him. impressive win right there. Tonight we saw another smash hit from Elias. That was a B-side at best. And that'll do it here for this one-on-one -on -one match. I hope you enjoyed. Now look at this. Uh-oh, oh, yeah. this is the confrontation we've all been waiting for. He's looking a little stunned right now. Yeah, definitely off of his game. Oh, no. One more time. 
Beautiful swinging neck breaker. Who wants to walk with Elias? Long demanded by the WWE Universe and the competitors in the women's division. The women's tag team titles are indeed here, and tonight they're on the line. We've seen alliances in the women's division forming for years, and it's culminating with these pairs facing off for the top prize in women's tag team competition. A striking blow. Elbow smash! And it's Alexa Bliss with the reversal. Hung out to dry across the middle rope. Oh, right to the throat. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Oh, working on the arm. Tagged in. Guys, we know Nikki Cross is the most unhinged superstar in the women's division, and Byron, she uses that reputation to her advantage. Yes, she does. It's part of the mind games with this scary Scott, and you definitely don't want to play them. She has reckless abandonment for logic and reason. If I were her opponent, I would avoid the insanity. Here we go. Leaping high! From behind. Big time neck breaker. Three. We talked on how Nikki Cross uses her reputation to play mind games. What do you think, Corey? Is Nikki's plan to get into her opponent's head? Four. Does Nikki Cross look to you like someone with a plan? She's like a dog that chases cars. She wouldn't know what to do with one if she caught it. Nikki Cross just, like, does things. Boom! Head first! The champ now absorbing a little damage. I really like the resolve you've seen her in this tag team match, guys. Though, I wouldn't be against the tag here. You know, just so she can gather herself again. Somehow, has to find a way to make a tag here. Completely agree. Getting the partner in here is absolutely vital. Looks like she's gonna make it, Corey! Yeah, but looks can be deceiving, Cole. You know that. Oh, she fails to make the tag. Talk about getting denied at the worst possible time. Masterful maneuver by Nikki Cross. Close line! Close line over the top! Man! I don't think anyone expected Alexa Bliss would win the SmackDown Women's Championship at TLC 2016. Well, anyone besides Alexa Bliss. But Bliss Prevail beating Becky Lynch for the title in a tables match. I totally knew that was going to happen. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Going up top. From the top. And the instinct from Nikki Cross on display. Oh, boy. Damn Suplex released. The challenger eating up some damage. She's putting up quite a fight here, Cole, but despite that, now is probably a good time to look for the tag. Hooked him up. And a suplex. We're going to make the tag here. Attack covered by the champ. She Put kicks out of that one. That would have been a shocker. Byron Bush really shocked the world when she beat Becky because the tables match is about a surprise. Normally it takes three seconds to win a match, but a quick power bomb through a table made history for Bliss. Yeah, people will say Bliss came out of nowhere to win. I mean, she was fresh from NXT where she never even had a takeover match. They didn't even have a t-shirt at the time. But since then, Bliss has truly evolved into the goddess of WWE. Desperately trying to get to the corner now. It's not going to be easy, though, Michael. So close, just a little bit more. Oh, but it's those last few inches that are always the toughest. There it is. She's made the tag. And her partner is on absolute fire right now. 
We are seeing a next level performance from these competitors tonight. They've shown a lot of resiliency. You have to give them that. And it's Alexa Bliss with the reversal. Defenseless in the corner now. Oh, oh what a crash. Knees and a prepare more insult to Ian Cover for the championship. And she kicks out at two, pinning Kyrie. I'd say that's an insane endeavor. <laughs> I'd say you're right. Alexa Bliss gets out of the way quickly. What a nasty fall. Struggling to get to the corner here. Might not make it, Michael. Here we go. She's almost there. The tag looks to be inevitable at this point. Somehow gets the tag. Hoping to make a tag here. It sounds like there are a lot of people here tonight hoping for the exact same thing. A missed attempt there. Listen, full control. DDT from Alexa Bliss. And the champ kicks out. Just powered out. What a punch. A heavy duty right hand. Stomping away. No surprise that what we're witnessing is trending. Forget trending on social media. The motion in the arena is charting on the Richter scale. For the championship! And another kick out. She's still in this one. Feet of Fury on the offense. The momentum is clearly turned to her favor. Nice right hand. On the apron now. Oh my God! She was planning. Watch again as all five feet of Fury is on display here. may be over sooner than later. I think we're gonna get the tag guy. Shoulders down, championship on the line! New champion! One, two, well, that was a close call. I'm having a hard time believing that one. She's got her in her sights. Nikki Cross. This is not going to be good for her opponent. Man, the champ's eyes were glazed over. I don't know. Sane can recover. Probably not. It went like that. Says a lot about a duo. How about another look at some of the highlights? Here are 
and Nikki Cross. The referee's three count ends this one. And there's your winner, folks. Let's not overcomplicate things. This business is simple. It's all about wins and losses. And it sure looks to me like somebody has figured that out. And that's exactly the type of action we've come to. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match and is for the Raw Women's Championship. Bad news, someone just drew the Queen of Spades. What's this? Well, I think it's about to be a highlight reel. That's twice now, Byron. Yeah, she really knows how to handle that, huh? The women's title is up for grabs. There's been women's titles defended in the WWE as early as the very first WrestleMania in 1985. But the competition has become even more heated over the last three years as the women's revolution took WWE by storm. Don't know if it's going to work, but Becky is playing mind games now. Now we have Becky Lynch on the attack. Becky Lynch is keeping a very good tempo. Momentum has clearly swung her way. The challenger is looking shaken. Yeah, but too soon to be worried. This one's about the women's championship, and nothing means more to these women than that title. And Shayna Baszler evades that one. Judging from the feeling inside this arena, I think this crowd knows they may very well witness history here in this match. As we've seen in the past, Extreme Rules matches create a type of hysteria that's difficult to describe, even more difficult to contain. There it is. Did you hear that crack? She's really relying on that object a lot now. And I can't say that I blame her. Becky Lynch with the offense. Becky Lynch is looking for the ending. Oh, there it is. Disarmor. It's got to be over. And she's able to break out of it. The lesson to learn here, Cole, is that you can never count her out. Is there something to focus on when preparing for this career-altering match? You've got to accept the fact that you're going to be punished like you've never been punished before. And no mercy will be given. In this situation, you can completely unload on your opponent and a referee's count can't stop you. You can set the rule book ablaze. Thank you, Lynch. Set the... Here she goes, back in the ring now. Nice right hand. Uh-oh. What a takedown. Fujiwara on bar. Taking out the arm, great strategy. Now it's Becky Lynch making her pay. Oh, calf kick on the mark. Oh, 
Oh, on the apron, lifting it up into the ring. Becky's on fire. Going to have a hard time stopping Becky when she's doing this. Kick right on point. the hold just when it looked like her night was over too oh what agility the arm bar is locked in lock amazingly she works her way free Cole there may be no beating her here tonight I have to say I feel like we are just one move away from claiming a winner in this one one more move or one more misstep either one can do it The reversal by Becky Lynch. Elbow Ooh. right to the back of the neck. Oof. In the corner now. <laughs> to the outside. making her think twice. Oh, and a slam! Oh, the sledgehammer connects. That'll scramble your insides. Again with it! She's showing no mercy tonight. And down, leg lariat. She's got her in her sights. Thank you, Lynch. Disarmor. It's got to be over. Thus, for some reason, she lets it go. Did you ever stop to think that she might have something else planned here? Inside the ring. Incoming. Ah, oh, the reversal. Becky Lynch, big backdrop. The champ trying to roll with these hits. Her opponent's making good use of the stipulation. She better watch out. Becky Lynch, just too fast for her. Using the ladder as a weapon. Ouch. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Remains champion. Becky Lynch taking in the moment as we look back at what unfolded. Here is your winner and still the Raw Women's Champion, Becky Lynch. Extremely impressive win, guys. Man, this champion has a stranglehold on that title and doesn't appear to be letting up anytime soon. What a spectacular championship match it was, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us.
Uh-oh, business is about to pick up. Jeez. Thank you, Lynch. Big splitter suplex. Oh, my goodness, crushing it. Nice takedown by Becky, looking for the armbar. Scoop slam. Remember, no rules in this one, guys. Man, Ziggler gets out of the way quickly. Lightning speed from Dolph. Boom, oh. what a forearm. And it's Dolph Ziggler with the reversal. How impressive was that reversal? Oh, I didn't see that coming from Otis. Woo-wee. Whoa, it's another reversal. Larian. Oh, foot just stomping down. I like it. That's what he does. Keeps on the attack. Saw that one coming. And hey, oh my God, what a forearm! Right to the jaw. Great reversal. I gotta say, I'm impressed. Byron, is it possible to avert disaster in a matchup like this? Competing in WWE is grueling enough, but when it's extreme rules and everything is legal, you are in a different level of combat. Things break down very quickly when you're only limited by your own destructive musings. Ah, oh, kick right to the gut. Devastating elbow. Boom. Oh, what a drop kick. On the mark. It's going to be interesting who comes up on top early on in this contest. Real quick reminder, guys, there are no disqualifications and no countouts in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. An impressive series of moves. Looks like nobody's budging, Cole. As Corey mentioned, there's a treasure trove of weapons under the ring. Everything from kendo sticks to steel chairs to fire extinguishers. If you can think about it, it's probably under there. And when that's the case, it's not a matter of if you're going to get hurt. It's a matter of how badly you're going to get hurt. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Wax it with the kendo stick. I don't think he's done yet, Cole. Oh, he's really taking it to him. Man, this is not good at all. Harsh impact. Dolph Ziggler getting trounced here. I'm not sure how he's even standing. Right now, Dolph needs to tap into that reserve tank if he wants to truly show the world how good he is. Got it. Mike, well, that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Dolph Ziggler turns it around. Oh, he went low. The humanity. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. Jam your leg in a bad way. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Doing some more damage here. Michael, that is so dangerous. Dolph well, Ziggler is now in control of the tempo of this match. Ziggler is unstoppable when he's feeling it like this. Now oh, striking. Look at Otis. Jumping DDT by the show-off. Oh, kick right to the gut. 
kick right to the leg. Back in from the floor. Nice headlock applied. Look at this athleticism. Oh, that was pretty cool. And it looks like this one's going out to the floor. Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Setting up again. I didn't see that coming from Otis. Ooh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. Too quick to catch him there. There it is. This he can pin his opponent right here. Get out. So resilient. Proving tough to catch. Sigler finds a way to power through. Oh, it could be nap time. Ziggler here continue to show that he can do things in the ring that no other superstar can do. Like silence 48,000 people in a baseball stadium. Here is your winner, Dolph Ziggler! What an incredible matchup, guys. This is an encounter that will live on for years to come. This is where Ziggler has to come back and show the world how good he really is. And it looks to me like our winner is already thinking about the next match. Always one step ahead. Extreme rules means anything goes and the fight can go anywhere in the arena, the locker room, or the parking lot. But pin or submission must occur in the ring. One of the dangers of an extreme rules match is it can very quickly turn into an all-out brawl. Well, a match like this shows what having devious intentions is all about. A competitor can't hesitate to do what they need to do. Suplex. Oh, stomping away. He's looking to fly. From the top. Bobby Lashley able to counter beautifully. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. The devil on his back must have helped Black kick out there. Whoa, Black able to avoid damage so quick. With all the destruction, with all the carnage, Byron, is there a key to victory in something like this? There cannot be any hesitation to do what you've got to do. You have to be aggressive and stay on the attack. That's what it's all about. Pull out all the stops, dig down deep, do what you have to do. This takes strength, speed, and innovation. And don't forget about a merciless mean streak. 
In my opinion, guys, one of the biggest moments in Aleister Black's early days here was his thrilling June 2017 victory over Cassius Ono in the main event of NXT. I'd agree, Michael. It was that night, I think, where fans realized Aleister Black can turn back all comers. And he proved that by defeating Ono, who outweighed him by more than 50 pounds. Nice right hand. Look, more on that Aleister Black Cassius Ono match, guys. To me, it just showed how great the striking ability is of both superstars. But in the end, of course, one superstar striking was that much better. Boom! Bicycle knee strike. Oh, oh, on the jaw. Great competitors, great superstars right here in WWE. Lastly, just barely got out of the way. He's looking a little weary now. It's extreme rules. Serious injury comes with the territory. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. Ouch. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Explosive assault from the Dutch Destroyer. Things are really going his way now. Oh, shows no mercy. And that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Oh, he's really taking it to him. Man, this is not good at all. Bobby Lashley able to counter beautifully. Reversal! What a counter! Well, what a sequence. Oh, what impact. He might have been waiting on that one. Boom! Bicycle knee strike. Oh, oh, on the jaw. He's calling for it. Black mass. It's over. He's got his best opportunity right in front of him. Will Bobby Lashley be able to continue? Finds a way to reverse. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Brutal knee right to the face. Doing some more damage here. Michael, that is so dangerous. Harsh impact. Did you hear that crack? it really relying on that tonight and he's heading back in perhaps he's thinking the ring can't contain what he has in mind here Michael, that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Oh, and that's the second time. You don't want to get hit with that once, let alone twice. Oh, and it's Black turning the tables.
Well, that'll hinder your modeling career. We are beginning to reach a point of desperation in this match. These athletes' bodies can only take them so far. You have to imagine they're reaching their breaking point. Good night, Black Mass! Now back to the ring. Boom! Bicycle knee strike. Oh, oh, on the jaw. Gonna be bad. It's gonna be really bad. Nasty. The hardest part of the ring. Close line. Oh, and it's black turning the tables. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. Wicked body shot. Double arm lock. Wow. He may be in a bad way here. Things are not looking good for him right now. Uh-oh. 
Nobody's getting up from Black Mass. And just like that, it's all over. What an exclamation mark right there. Black with the W. What a victory. Watch here, the almighty Bobby Lashley should have focused more on the opposition instead of posing. Here is your winner, Alistair Black! And what a great win here for Alistair Black. The Dutch Destroyer can return to the darkness knowing he's made a clear statement tonight. Received loud and clear. And it's matches like this one that make SmackDown such a success. Thank you so much. Kevin Owens is ready for a fight. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Marieville, Quebec, Canada. What's going on here? Oh man, there it is. And we have other things are about to get interesting. Kevin Owens has repeatedly stated that winning is the only thing that matters to him, and KO will do whatever it takes to add the architect to his list of fallen opponents. I can't imagine what's going through the mind of Kevin Owens right now. Owens knows Seth Rollins will stop at nothing to defeat an opponent, especially him. And KO and Seth Rollins know each other so well. Tonight, Kevin is looking to prove that he is the top superstar in WWE and that Rollins isn't anywhere near his level. by Kevin Owens. Straight punch. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. Oh, and the ladder finds the mark. Gonna be tough to bounce back from that one. In this type of match, Byron, how does a superstar combat against the fact that they could fall victim to a vicious and hellacious attack? Well, the difficult part is once an opponent gets the upper hand, you have to stop the onslaught yourself. There are no rope breaks, no five counts. Yeah, the referee is truly only there to count pinfall attempts and check to see if a combatant submits. Seth Rollins got on a dangerous path there. Great move by the architect. doing a great job of turning that one around. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. Back between the ropes. Perhaps he's thinking the ring can't contain what he has in mind here. Uh, Seth Rollins made him pay with the counter there. Rollins is so smart inside that ring. Uh -oh. Oh, oh my goodness, crushing it. Kevin Owens just too fast for him. Surprisingly quick. Whoa, not so fast. Face buster. Oh, Seth got him there. Big move by the architect. Boom! <laughs> you cannot stop Seth Rollins, guys. Well, the architect is rolling now. All the way from the top rope. A quick reversal by Kevin Owens. Big miss for him there. Face first from Rollins. It is so easy to stay in touch with your superstars 24-7 in a variety of social media outlets, including WWE's own Facebook page. 
Seth Rollins playing a little head games right now. Bam! Suplex! Kevin Owens just too fast for him. Surprisingly quick. Seth Rollins got out of there in the nick of time. They should count his lucky stars. Kevin Owens with the pump handle applied. Neck front, there's the cover. Can he do it? One, two, Kicks out on the pinfall attempt. He's got some more fight in him, guys. Now trampling the opposition. Seth Rollins gets out of trouble. And quickly. DDT! Fight! The tension. The drama. This is electric. These competitors are just trying to stay under control. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Now watch this. Kevin Owens is a force within the ring. Here we go. Kevin Owens is setting it up. Uh-oh. Stun, Owens, stun. Turn the lights out. Good night. Now Kevin Owens needs to capitalize on this opportunity. I think Owens realizes that. I don't know how Kevin Owens or Seth Rollins is able to move at this point. Where are these men finding the strength? Right now it's about who can come up big in the clutch. Seth Rollins finds a way out. Uh, Seth Rollins made him pay with the counter there. Oh, right up there. Kevin Owens with the pump handle applied. Nick, he could pin his opponent right here. It's over. Two, three. Kevin Owens did it. Kevin Owens did it. Now let's look back at that amazing action. Kevin Owens credit his offense was too much for Uh oh business is about to pick up A quick reversal by Kevin Owens Set Bump handle bump handle into the Next breaker my goodness Uh oh Stunner Owens hits the stun The champion has no intention on tonight being their final night with the title. The champion came out here somewhat gloating their belt around. Don't know if that's their way of playing mind games. That title should give anyone the right to gloat. Look, 
What good is it being on top of the mountain if you don't get to look down on everybody else? That is a sad attitude to have. Plenty of fight left. Still too fresh. Braun Strowman doing a great job of turning that around. Not showing much fight here. Yeah, he looks absolutely out of it, Cole. Close line. What a close line. Ouch. Saw that one coming. Wow, what a sequence. Launched with a belly to belly. One. Plenty of fight left. That's either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. Oh, what a four. He might have been waiting on that one. Line. Forcefully delivered. He's lost some of his win now. He had to be prepared to take some damage. To him. Oh, what a right! Man, that's some attitude behind it. Caught him with a big boot on the mark. Whoa, Strowman dodged that one. From what heights? Byron, is it possible to avert disaster in a matchup like this? Competing in. Braun has him up. Thunderous power slam. Here's his window. Will he take advantage? Did you see the impact on that? Wow. As you may remember, Kurt Angle actually fired Braun Strowman back in January of 2018, and guys. I can't help but wonder how different the WWE landscape would be if that firing actually stuck. Oh, Corey, he unloaded there. Goldberg doing a great job of turning that around. Braun Strowman doing a great job of turning that around. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. On the topic of Strowman's temporary firing, I could think of more than a few superstars who wished it stuck. Kane and The Bar immediately come to mind, considering what he did to them at the Royal Rumble and WrestleMania, respectively. I don't disagree, Saxton, but let's be honest. The true highlight from Strowman's firing was when he launched Michael Cole off the raw stage like a long dart. <laughs> that was kind of funny. Shut up. Oh, and he lands it. Really relying on that tonight. Goldberg just barely got out of the way. Oh, shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Goldberg is in trouble and hurt right now. He's going to come out of this Extreme Rules match a different man. Goldberg needs to tap into his trademark intensity and mount a comeback as soon as possible. Earth-shattering offense from Braun. That's what he does. Keeps on the attack. Again. Hey, it seems to be working for him. Oh, shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Man, Braun Strowman, what offense. Boom! Boom, oh, what impact. Boom! Oh, nasty impact. Doing some more damage here. Michael, that is so dangerous. <laughs> Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. What a clothesline! Oh, you are in trouble now. Oh. Can't break in the midsection. And it's Goldberg answering back. Not again. One of these competitors is eventually going to have to gain the upper hand. Taking it to him. Man, this is not good at all. Whack! 
Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Ooh, well measured. And what a reversal from Goldberg. Braun Strowman doing a great job of turning that around. Gets him with a counter. What a punch! Oh, and he lands it. Really relying on that tonight. Oh, shows no mercy. And that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Great counter. Impressive in-ring IQ on display. Bringing it back into the ring. Goldberg is making his presence known. Whoa, Strowman dodged that. And here's the monster along there. Corey, look at the power. That kind of move makes a statement. The situation just got real big. Braun Strowman wins. Braun Strowman wins. Unfortunately for Braun's opponent, as you can see, he got those hands. showing there and root to the win. Oh my God, Goldberg loses. It happened when he became 173 and one, and it happened again tonight. In my estimation, the greatest of all time, the 16-time world champion, John Cena. There aren't too many people who would argue with you, Michael Cole. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from West Newberry, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 251 pounds. No one in the history of WWE has done for this company what John Cena has. Not only inside the ring, but outside the ring. Arguably the biggest star in WWE history and, well, on his way to becoming the biggest star, perhaps in Hollywood, too. Proclaimed by Mr. McMahon as the Babe Ruth of WWE, there is nothing John Cena has not accomplished in sports entertainment. Michael, it's got to feel like yesterday for you when you saw John Cena win his first WWE Championship by defeating JBL at WrestleMania 21. That was back in 2005. You can call me old. No, I'm just saying you're a historian. I have never seen anything like this in my life. What exactly is that? This crowd is stunned. 
I feel stunned. This uncomfortable feeling has just taken over the entire WWE Universe. Making his presence felt. Just such an eerie existence. And his opponent, weighing in at 285 pounds, The Fiend, Bray Wyatt. Mind control, it seems. I'll do you one better, Michael. It's just pure evil. Can you imagine? Now look at this. Uh-oh, here we go. Look out here. He's got something cooking. Look at this. Oh well, we had a feeling this could we had a feeling this would happen. Oh, and it's Cena turning the tables. John Cena with a nice reversal. Oh, on a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. Ooh, that hurt. What a punch that was. Oh, Corey, he unloaded there. What a forearm. In this type of match, Byron, how does a superstar combat against the fact that they could fall victim to a vicious and hellacious attack? Well, the difficult part is once an opponent gets the upper hand, you have to stop the onslaught yourself. There are no rope breaks, no five counts. Yeah, the referee's truly only there to count pinfall attempts and check to see if a combatant submits. Bray Wyatt reverses it. And up the turnbuckle. Here we go. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, it's a piercing elbow. If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially no rules are one giant free-for-all where absolutely anything can happen. Saw that one coming. I like the way you describe this match, Byron. It's one giant free-for-all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture on these superstars. It is, Cole. And unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury. Sometimes serious injury. What in the world is happening? Weirdo. An impressive series of moves. Looks like nobody's budging, Cole. The Exploder Suplex Slam. Looking to catch him off guard. Plenty of fight left. He just powered out there, Cole. You'll often see the words never give up on John Cena's clothing, and he truly lives by those words. Cena has spent over 15 years working hard to be the best, and he'll never quit on the WWE Universe. I'm kind of astonished that as long as Cena's been around, we rarely see him take shortcuts. Heck, the guy literally won't quit. He'd rather pass out in pain than admit defeat and tap out. This is just going to be physical. There's no other way to describe it. Ooh, oh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. I'm not giving up on the conversation about John Cena. That phrase, never give up, has inspired so many of Cena's fans. Terminally ill children, members of the military. Cena fights hard so that they can fight even harder. Yeah, you have to be inspired by a guy with Cena's work ethic. He's fighting harder now than he was when he was a rookie. Nobody can doubt Cena when he utters those three words. Not showing much fight here. Yeah, he looks absolutely out of it, Cole. What a Ray Wyatt might get an early three count. Cena shakes off things like that in his sleep. Oh, 
could be nap time. Great job breaking the hold there. Good thing, too. That could have been ugly, Michael. Here's Cena. Hey! Glad I put my money on that guy tonight. But can John Cena capitalize? And John Cena is your winner. No doubt it was a good one. Here's another look. in the house. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Weighing in at 193 pounds. The WWE Cruiserweight Champion, Drew Gulak. The fact is, Drew Gulak is a skilled mat technician. He pays great attention to detail, especially when it means manipulating the human anatomy. Corey, given that the title is not on the line here, will motivation be an issue for the champ tonight? Absolutely not, Cole. He doesn't care if the title's on the line or not. He just wants to kick somebody's teeth in. Cesaro's about to uppercut something. And his opponent, representing the bar from Lucerne, Switzerland, weighing in at 232 pounds. You know, he had one of the all-time great rivalries with Sheamus, but Corey, it ended up working out in the favor for both men. Forming a tag team now known as The Bar. Sheamus and Cesaro's bond was based on mutual respect for how tough, for how physical one another truly are, and the fact that they forced each other to raise their levels. The Swiss Cyborg, one of the strongest physical superstars in WWE. If you can dream it up, Cesaro can pull it off.
There's always one type of match in the WWE that is wilder than wild when things go extreme and the landscape of the WWE changes in unpredictable ways. It's extreme rules. Absolutely, Michael. Rules are out the window in this one. And that means the consequences are huge for every superstar in this match. Oh, that's a thing, Byron. Many superstars have had their career derailed by an extreme rules match. But just as many have had their careers launched into the stratosphere. It's only a matter of time until we see which is which. Nothing like extreme rules. Man, look at the quickness of Gulak. Bringing it back into the ring. Reverses. Can he make him pay? Oh, heavy duty right hand. With all the destruction, with all the carnage, Byron, is there a key to victory in something like this? There cannot be any hesitation to do what you've got to do. You have to be aggressive and stay on the attack. That's what it's all about. Pull out all the stops, dig down deep, do what you have to do. This takes strength, speed, and innovation. And don't forget about a merciless mean streak. No, another reversal. Neither one of them are willing to give an inch here. Byron, he looks like he has no idea where he is. Yeah, he is definitely on Dream Street, Michael. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Relentless offense was part of slide 45. This is what he feeds off of. What incredible technical prowess from Cesaro. In matches like this, guys, you learn very quickly which superstars have what it takes to truly get extreme. Oh, he's really taking it to him. Man, this is not good at all. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Cesaro definitely tiring out there. Yeah, he's looking off his game now. There's going to be a lot of big moves in this match. But one question is going to be, who will capitalize on those moves the best? Not looking good right now. Simply said, this is going to be a great match. Man, look at the quickness of Gulak. Oh, well, game strike. Now that's how you use a table to your advantage. Close line right to the back of the neck. Reversal. Cesaro showing his prowess. Now's the time to find that second win. Find that rush of adrenaline to push you forward. Oh, and it's Gulak turning the tables. Brought in the hard way. Dragon Sleeper! 
your winner. Tonight was not a night Cesaro wants to remember. Here is your winner, Drew Gulak. A very decisive victory here tonight. Oh, handed to Drew Gulak. His research and studies got him a win here tonight. Well, that was indeed a great match. And I think it's worth emphasizing how huge this victory is. Liv Morgan's in the house. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making her way to the ring from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Liv Morgan. One of the only good things to ever come out of the state of New Jersey. Jersey tough, there's no doubt about that. Successful career coming in WWE. And here comes Natalia. And from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, no. Natalia holds the record for the longest time spent in a women's Royal Rumble match at 56 minutes. That's a minute for each cat she owns. A third generation competitor, granddaughter of Stu Hart, niece of Bret Hart, and daughter of Jim Neidhart, Natalia was born to do this. Extreme rules means anything goes and the fight can go anywhere in the arena, the locker room, or the parking lot. But pin or submission must occur in the ring. One of the dangers of an extreme rules match is it can very quickly turn into an all-out brawl. A match like this shows what having devious intentions is all about. A competitor can't hesitate to do what they need to do. Damn. And it's Natalya with the reversal. Double underhook applied. Lariat. Boom, what impact. Ooh, what impact. Extraordinary offense from Morgan. The momentum is clearly turned to her favor. We have witnessed incredible brutality in this type of match. Corey, what could be a key factor in this one? This is a form of battle where if you have a shot, you better take it because you might not get another chance. There are no limits. There are no boundaries. Every resource is at your disposal. Every dream of destroying your opponent can become a reality. Natalia now in a little bit of trouble. She still has a lot of time to recover, though. She's dazed in the corner there. From the hallowed ground of the Heart Dungeon in Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Natalia debuted in WWE at odds with the Bella Twins and managed the Heart Dynasty to the WWE Tag Team Championship. Liv Morgan just barely got out of the way. Crank. 
to the outside. Natalya began competing in singles action and formed a dominating alliance with Beth Phoenix soon after the Queen of Hearts was part of the debut season of E's Total Divas reality show and added a red carpet correspondent to her resume. Natalya returned to managing and led Tyson Kidd and Cesaro to WWE Tag Team Gold before reinvigorating her singles career, which included a classic match for the NXT Women's Championship against Charlotte. A driving force of the women's revolution today, Natalya's goal is to dominate the women's division. It's locked in now. She better do something fast. And here's another look at what made that match so special. Here is your winner, Natalya! The following contest is an Extreme Rules match and is for the WWE Championship. This man is a real force, Drew McIntyre. What the? I don't think we're going to wait for the match to start. Oh, man. There it is. Here we go. The World Heavyweight Champion is ready to defend his ground. I don't think I see an ounce of doubt in the champion. He absolutely believes he's leaving tonight with his title, Byron. Well, it would be hard to argue with him, Michael. I can tell by the way he entered the arena today that he was in a different kind of zone. The type of zone that only champions go to. Got it. Michael, that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Brock Lesnar with a nice reversal. An impressive series of moves. Looks like nobody's budging, Cole. These two heavyweights have worked their entire lives for this, and the night has finally arrived. We'll see who will claim the WWE World Heavyweight title. As we've seen in the past, Extreme Rules matches create a type of hysteria that's difficult to describe, even more difficult to contain. And again, yet another counter. In this type of match, Byron, how does a superstar combat against the fact that they could fall victim to a vicious and hellacious attack? Well, the difficult part is once an opponent gets the upper hand, you have to stop the onslaught yourself. There are no rope breaks, no five counts. Yeah, the referee is truly only there to count pinfall attempts and check to see if a combatant submits. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no count outs. Back in the ring again. Larian. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Now it's Lesnar taking some punishment. He planned for this and could still rally. McIntyre's brutal attacks are truly next level. Just producing an onslaught. Oh, he's really taking it to him. Man, this is not good at all. Ha! Now it's Lesnar making him pay. And there's the reversal from Drew McIntyre. Nice offense from Drew McIntyre. Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the beast. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Producing a trampling. Doing some more damage here. Michael, that is so dangerous. Harsh impact. Ooh, what impact.
the championship hanging in the balance. Championship on the line. Brock Lesnar is a beast in every way you can imagine. Oh, Corey, he unloaded there. Again. Hey, it seems to be working for him. Brock Lesnar has taken on a lot of damage. I'm not sure how much is left in the tank. He won't quit, but it might be better if he did. Right now, Brock needs to find the form that has made him a dominant force. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Boom, right in the button. trouble here. Uh-oh. Future shock DDT. Glad I put my money on that guy tonight. That's one of those moves. Drew McIntyre gets the win. How does one survive the beast? Here's your answer. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. That was a huge win. I am awestruck, gentlemen. We just witnessed another human being overcome the Beast Incarnate. I'd like to think we just saw one of the greatest title matches in a very...